which is seven to nine degrees Celsius. That's all from me. I hope you have a wonderful Christmas Eve. Bye bye. Live from London, this is BBC News. Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu dismisses reports that the United States has convinced him not to expand the country's military activities in the Middle East. Israel is a sovereign country. Our war decisions are based on our operational considerations. Christmas celebrations have been called off in Bethlehem. The usual Christmas tree is replaced by a nativity scene in the rubble. The UK Home Secretary James Cleverley has apologised after joking about spiking his wife's drink with a date rape drug. And the missing Carol discovered after 90 years in Yorkshire. Hello and welcome to BBC News. We start with the war in Gaza where Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu who has dismissed reports that the United States has convinced Israel not to expand its military activity. He was speaking during a weekly cabinet meeting. On Saturday, the Wall Street Journal reported that President Biden had urged the Israeli Prime Minister to halt a preemptive strike against Hezbollah forces in Lebanon days after her mass militants launched their October the 7th assault on southern Israel, warning that such an attack could spark a wider regional war. Well, this was the view from uh, across the Israel-Lebanon border a few hours ago, where we saw a thick plume of black smoke in the sky with continued hostilities in that border area. Well, we've been hearing, as we're saying, from Israel's Prime Minister a little earlier today. Let's hear a little more of that. Last night, I talked.